wax canvas, full grain leather, easy access zipper and made in the US of A. The nut sack rucksack here it is so whether this bag is for you or not we've got to give it credit where it's due that is a cool name man so i've said it from the beginning of this channel i'm only going to accept gear that i see potential in gear that is fitted and tailored towards our channel and things that i see myself using long term rather than just doing a quick video on and then it's done out the window so that being said i want to give out a massive thank you to nutsack for sending this over for me to try out and yeah it's not disappointed so far it's spot on so let me tell you a bit more about it so the nutsack rucksack is a 20 litre bag which i think we can all agree is a perfect day pack although saying that and you can all hold me to this as well saying that i do want to go out and do an overnight camp with just this bag alone just to prove to myself i can do it so we'll get into the the inside of the pack in a second but you'll see in there there's lots of different compartments and that lots of space to work with and keep things organized so doing overnight is yes it'll be a stretch i'll have to go pretty lightweight but i'm telling you it's possible and i will prove it so starting with the outside of the pack it's made from wax canvas which was a highlight feature for me and as we all know with being made from wax canvas it's a very heavy duty it's going to stand up to some punishment whether that be from the weather it's going to be water resistant or just general outdoor use especially in the woodland i need something that can handle a few scrapes and a few scratches when i'm hiking through some dense forest or dense bush in addition to the wax canvas it has a leather bottom and again that's just going to give me additional protection from when i'm putting it on and off the ground i will say one thing about this and i'm being pretty self-absorbed at the moment but what I would have loved to see on this pack is similar to my Italian Alpini mountain rucksack. It has little loops on the bottom where I can tie like a heavy duty shoelace through and then I'm able to attach a wool blanket or sleeping bag to and that would truly make this pack an overnight style rucksack rather than just a day pack but then that's very specific to my needs and we do have the leather bottom on here which is a, a great added on feature in itself so we have a side pocket on each side and granted they aren't the biggest but again it just helps with that sleek uh, minimal design and they do have a button you can pop open to give yourself extra room if you need it it's got a nice heavy duty grab handle again with extra leather around it for additional protection the shoulder straps are quite thick and nicely padded now you often find on the smaller 20 liter packs that um the shoulder straps are quite thin but not on this one nicely padded so thumbs up for that and lastly on the outside of the pack we have this easy access zipper now this just makes it really easy convenient to get inside your rucksack when it's full up get in there and get something out from the bottom or the middle without taking everything out from the top right so that's all the outside stuff done so let's delve on in and see what we've got going on on the inside of the pack so straight away as you can see we have this uh, nice little draw drawstring cord is that how you say it draw cord uh, i never really use these i've got them on all my packs i never really use them i just keep them open just for speed but nonetheless you can tell the the quality is there we've got the nutsack logo along with made in the usa now this label and that's just a label but that looks pretty smart in my opinion so firstly on the inside of the pack you've just got one nice big compartment and i've already tested it and you can get um at least a snug pack jungle bag slotted in there so it's a summer sleeping bag but it does fit pretty nicely in this pack we've also got a specific compartment for laptops now if you watch girl outdoors and now she like goes off to the woods and that and she does all her editing she takes laptop and just does all her editing out there so now it sounds mad but uh, maybe i might get amongst that now and go out to the woods and just sit there for the day doing me video edits it's a nice thought but uh mostly this pocket will mostly be used for me grill like me cook set you know um i can slot me grill in there nicely i'm not taking up any more space it's nicely stored away 
in the laptop compartment. And one last thing on this pocket is that it's slightly raised from off the ground. So when you're dropping your bag on and off the floor, picking it up and on the floor, you're not worried about knocking your laptop if you're asked on a laptop in there. So it's raised up slightly, which uh, yeah, just a bit of extra security. Nice little touch that one. There's also a zippered pocket in front of that. Now that's only hands deep. I suppose, yeah, it fits, it fits my hand in there pretty nicely. So here's all your bits and bobs and that, maybe it's a headlight or something. And then on the opposite side, we have two smaller pouches, again, just for little bits and bobs, store in there, keep it nicely organized, which is uh, always good when you're out camping or hiking about, you want to know where everything is in your pack at all times. And oh yeah, there's a, there's a loop here with um, a, a clip with a button, a loop and a button. I'm not too sure what that is in intended for and I don't know what I could use that for at this moment in time but I'm sure eventually I'll uh, I'll find some use for it but I don't know might as well have it I don't know what it's for to be honest but uh yeah might as well have it I'm sure it'll come in useful at some point so there we go what do you think of me uh my new deer pack my new scout pack i can do a bit of gray man type stuff as well if i'm going into the woods and i want to be a bit more discreet instead of carrying like a, a proper backpack and pack or like a military tactical bag this is very uh, suited for all scenarios and going to the woods without like looking suspicious or anything and i can just go off kind of meetings or something i'll go down the coffee shop with this pack on it suits all types of areas so uh i'm really happy with it the quality is there so yeah that is it man like i said although this rucksack was sent out to me for free which i am very grateful for i didn't have any obligations to make a video on it and um, they sent me out said oh you might like this pack no obligation so yeah respect for that i appreciate it but like i said i'll only accept stuff like this if i genuinely see myself using and this pack the overall build quality and everything with the wax canvas and the leather you can tell it's going to last a long time and that is my intention to have this is my day pack going forward and I can see myself using it long term. If you want to know more about Nutsack, the company, they do loads of different things for like your EDC gear, um, lots of different stuff. I'm going to leave their YouTube channel in the description along with their website. So definitely go check them out because if you like the look at this, you're definitely going to find uh, some more interesting stuff on their channel. They also do free giveaways on their website. So for that reason alone, like you might as well go check it out, see what's going on. And one last thing before I finish off this video is if you're here in the UK, like me, obviously they're an, an American company, so they're gonna be shipping over there. So I believe you will have to pay the custom tax and all the rest of the, uh, the stuff you need to do, but that applies to if you're shipping from any country, I think. So I just thought I'd mention that. You probably know already. But yeah, thank you for watching and supporting this channel. Proper legend. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace.